one, go. Freedom Gladiators, they spin a roller to red. Revision spins a roller to blue. We've got firing on both sides. Four discs, five discs, make that four discs in the blue eye goal. Five, six, six, seven maybe discs in the blue high goal. We've got three in the red high goal, four, five in the red high goal. Lots of action all over the place. It looks like we have four rollers scored as well. There are eight discs in the blue high goal. And so the blue alliance is going to get the autonomous bonus. We'll resume now with driver control in three, two, one, go. Eight discs in the blue high goal. That is 40 points that are unlikely to be descored at any point in this match, plus a 10 point bonus that cannot be descored at all. That gives the Blue Alliance a huge leg up, but already the Red Alliance looking to equalize. Juggernaut, three discs up. One, two, three from Freedom Gladiators. Only two remain, that's five out of six for those two Red Robots in their latest firing attempt each. Juggernaut's getting into a fight with Revision, but they're backing off. And here comes one, two, three discs from Freedom Gladiators, both of those high goals looking very full. Juggernaut's taking a shot with three, but only one disc manages to stay up there. Iron Eagles with two, three discs loaded up. They're gonna try and fire them at the blue high goal. One, two, three, go up, but all three come tumbling down because that goal is incredibly full. Revision still getting in a fight with Freedom Gladiators. Two foes driving across the field was as Revision completely removed Freedom Gladiators from one corner and deposited them in the opposite corner. One, two, three discs go up by Freedom Gladiators and somehow there's still room in that red high goal. There's 37 seconds on the clock. Freedom Gladiators steals a roller. Iron Eagles shoving into them, but Freedom Gladiators with control of two rollers in the same corner. And in the corner closest to me, we've got two rollers. The Red Alliance attempting to control them both. Juggernauts with one, but Revision steals them both back. It looks like to, to be too close to call over here. We have a roller turning neutral back to blue. Looks like two blue, two red rollers. There's one disc inside of Juggernauts. There are three discs in the low red zone, and we are now in the final 10 seconds. Let's see if any of these teams choose to expand. We have Iron Eagles expanding. We have Revision expanding. Juggernauts chose not to expand, but Freedom Gladiators did. An incredibly high scoring match. Excitement all around. Shots fired by 100A all the way from across the field. 4082B goes in for their own kill. Three discs into the blue zone, two in the red, three more flying into the red. Only one makes it in there. A lot more blue discs in the blue basket. And an active cheering squad over there, a one man cheering squad. Rollers about even. Difference of one disc for the upper goals. Blue. Blue takes autonomous. Let's get going with driver control. In three, two, one. 8364 goes right for a couple of discs. Same thing with 4082B. Right now, they're in the blue scoring zone, trying to get a couple more discs and a couple of easy shots. Same thing as 9364C. 515 collecting some discs. Unopposed, they go in for three shots, making two of them easily. Rollers being covered by 100A. Meanwhile, 4082 getting all the discs that they can. Right now, it is almost even money between these two teams as to who has the advantage on the discs. 100A gets a couple more easy shots in there. Same thing with 9364. They are overloading their basket. Right now, 515 gets three more shots in, but they just slide across a very even basket of discs there. 100A trying to protect their corner. 9364 goes right in for it, and they just get pushed around by 100A. Managed to get one roller scored on that. 515R also fighting for the other corner there against 4082. Mainly because there's only two discs on the floor. Everything else has been scored up there. Shaking of the field has knocked out at least one disc from the blue upper goal area. That is how tenuous this is. 30 seconds left in the match. Pushing match between 9364 and 100A has pretty much ended in a stalemate. 515R is just going around in circles with 4028 
B. 20 seconds left in the match. Pretty much everything is gonna come down to the end game here. 515R still protecting the corner. 4028 still trying to get another roller. Still a stalemate between 100A and 9364. 9364 throws out a tent to try to stop 100A, but it was not enough to stop them. 9364 shows up. Same thing with 4028 and 515. All four robots have shown out at their end game. It ain't very scary. One, go! As we get started here in Autobot Freedom, Gladiators spin a roller, Revision spins a roller, discs being fired on all cylinders from all corners of the field. Revision taking a couple more shots at the blue high goal. The blue high goal looks to have six or seven discs, make that maybe six or seven. Red high goal also looks to have about five or six. All rollers are scored. It is even on rollers. There appear to be five discs in the red low zone and three in the blue low zone. There are six discs in the blue high goal and only five in the red high goal. The Blue Alliance wins the autonomous bonus and we will now resume with driver control in three, two, one, go. We are back in action here. Freedom Gladiators immediately stealing a blue roller for red, dumping a couple of discs in that high goal. Eagles with a couple of discs trying to shoot at the blue high goal. Juggernauts are stuck on the edge of the red low zone, the boundary getting pushed. It's Freedom Gladiators trying to save them and it looks like they are finally free. Juggernauts back in action with three discs loaded up, shooting all three and getting 15 points on that red high goal. 75 seconds still on the clock. That is plenty of time. We've got Iron Eagles taking three shots. All three are good. 15 points in that blue high goal and going to fill up. Revision taking a couple of shots at the blue high goal. Very few discs remaining on the ground now. Freedom Gladiators going to steal two blue rollers. They get them both over for red. That's a net 40 point gain for the Red Alliance. Minus 20 blue, plus 20 red. Freedom Gladiators getting in a bit of a pushing match. They went over looking at stealing a couple of rollers, getting pushed into the corner by Iron Eagles, but they do have some maneuverability still. And Freedom Gladiators going back to steal a couple more rollers. One, two, discs up, and both land in the red high goal. Only a couple of discs left. Freedom Gladiators taking another shot, but it falls short. Dugglenaut's taking a shot, but it bounces off the backboard into that blue low scoring zone. There's now 25 seconds to go here. Iron Eagles trying to keep Freedom Gladiators stuck in a corner and prevent them from descoring two blue rollers. All four rollers are blue. Freedom Gladiator says, let's make that only three. Give us one of those rollers back, but they're getting shoved into the side wall by Revision. And now we are in the end game. There's less than 10 seconds left. Iron Eagle's trying to put up a blocker to prevent Juggernauts, but it looks like we've got three end games being launched. The only end game remaining from Freedom Gladiators. That's gonna wrap up our final five.